Let's customize this chart a bit. Let's make it a little taller. And let's hide the grid lines. And then let's make it a smooth graph. OK, looks nice. Let's go ahead and add our second chart. We'll call it uh, time series for the mean squared error. We'll paste in the same code for the data source. Let's use a time series bar chart. We'll use our custom code as a data source. We'll use the start time as a time column. But then we'll do average mean squared error for the booster. It's good. We'll also do the average for that linear regression model and the average for the lasso model. Awesome. Oh, there's a lot of bars. Maybe we'll change the interval to a oh, minute. Seems too much. Let's do hour. It looks better. And the x-axis looks a little scrunched up, so let's format that. Let's do, yeah, let's try this, the day and then the hour. OK, looks OK. Let's do that better. OK. Then that looks weird, too. Maybe we'll just do just the hour. Padded with the zero. And let's see how it looks. Looks good. Let's put it on the same row. And let's put it second. And let's change the height. Let's make these smaller since we'll add a few other charts.